welcome back to the channel uh, as, I, as I said before if you do like what I do here please do consider subscribing and clicking the bell for notifications because I do cover lots of Crystal Palace news just as well as the reviews as well so uh, if you want to keep up to date with the news and do subscribe and uh, stay with me so looking ahead to the West Ham game um, we have the predicted lineup on here on the evening standard along with confirmed team news injuries and the COVID latest as you know COVID has really hit a lot of um, a lot of clubs not just in the Premier League but clubs across the country a lot of fixtures have been called off but um, it looks like West Ham is still looking good at least from their point of view um, it says that their their New Year trip to Crystal Palace have no fresh coronavirus cases at the moment although um, David Morris does say that that is obviously uncertain but it changes every day Michel Antonio and Pablo Fornaus uh, are the only two players that have missed games because of positive tests uh, but um, with, the, with uh, four hours set to be in isolation for Saturday's London derby. So it looks like he's going to be, he's still going to be unavailable for the game against Crystal Palace, which could be a good thing. Antonio did come back on Boxing Day and uh, got a goal in their win against Watford. So uh, it's looking like um, they're kind of back into their winning ways again. Um, Moy said, we don't have any more numbers, but as everybody is saying, that is something which you can't really say now because it changes every day. And uh, it looks as though they're going. This is this is well. This is the predictive team that they they're going to put out. I'm not sure it's going to be exactly like this. But Declan Rice is going to be back to the side following suspension, and uh, Benarama is said to be is available for the final time before joining the uh, Algerian team for the African Cup of Nations. So Declan, it's not Declan Rice. So um, Benarama will be available, so whether he plays or not. Um, obviously, it's difficult to say. But this is when it's going to be, the 1st of January on Saturday. So that'll be tomorrow at the time of recording this video. It's going to be on Sky Sports. Uh, referee's Michael Oliver, which is okay, I guess. And um, and it looks like at the moment they've got uh, Obdono with a knee injury, Zuma with a hamstring, Cresswell with his back, and Fournier's with COVID. So they look like the only injuries they've got at the moment. So they've got a pretty good squad. So I reckon it's going to be a tough game for us. I'm probably going to be edging towards a draw on there as well. Will Will Zaha come back? I'm not entirely sure. I, I think I think Vieira will put him back in, but um, I'll certainly give him food for thought after the last game when he wasn't available and he did play very well. Anyway, so that's the prediction and all the setup for the game against West Ham, which is coming up on New Year's Day. Let me know what you think. Whether you uh, whether you would uh, be worried about West Ham United, or do you think that we've got enough in our in our team to uh, to win one over? I think it's going to be a draw. But let me know what you think down in the comments. Until next time, see you later. Bye-bye.